this here is what I'm going to describe as the easiest way to get wood on this game. And this is brilliant. This is wood production by NYKK3, 4.54 megabyte on the download. And you're going to find this pack in three different categories. So we go into the construction menu. The first one is going to be obviously the wood production, which is actually under greenhouses for some strange reason but all right fair enough 20 grand place that down obviously that's going to make your wood then we'll come back up to buildings and we'll go under silos and we'll scroll all the way along to the end because that's where this one's hiding they are 80 grand that's going to be for the timber storage this building here and then the last part of this is going to be back under productions and selling points and it's going to be to sell your wood off if you want it to just there simple little grate not a problem now what this does is it grows wood for you and not in the planting in the field sort of wait a couple of years for it to be ready situation this does it excellently so you come over here you got your production chain menu there we'll go into that this is what we've got wood production <laughs> this is ace so you've got three different recipes for making wood so the first one requires water and seed the second one requires water seed and manure you then got water seed and slurry and you can also make planks out of this you gotta put wood in you got a slow and a fast version obviously that's done on the actual cycles per month but we'll come back to that shortly so we're going to go up for the making water itself first off fair enough now for this obviously you put your water in there you then come around the back so you put your seed in and your manure or slurry whichever one you're going for and then if you're making wood it comes out here on a pallet now you can't pick it up it's too heavy but what you can do if you come with this auto load trailer is it the auto load pack by rowley christie one and vsr modding sir yeah come over there like that jobs are good in auto loading wood you don't even have to get a forklift truck which is ace now what you can do is if you wanted to make planks fair enough but there's a bit of an issue with that and they say it does it all right it's not a problem you want to load wood into here and then hit the sell wood icon like you normally would do on a sawmill yes no problem and obviously you take out the wood chips from there the only issue with that is the speed of it so we've got cycles per month on the slow 360 and then on the fast version 720 but I've also placed down a standard sawmill, 2,400 cycles per month. So with a normal sawmill, you're going to get it done a lot quicker. And also you got there on the recipe, you got 3.7 planks, 3.3 planks. On a normal sawmill, you got four. So it's a little bit slower. It will do it, just not as quick. Fair enough. This is going to be made for basically doing the wood in the first place, which is ace. Now what you can do as well with the silo if we bring this vehicle over and we'll put it into there you are come on tractor put your finger out come over here into the hatch marking area obviously you can use this with normal wood you don't have to use the ones from this pack it'll take normal wood not a problem just do it like that unload it and it's gone straight in if you come in with the normal wood on the back of a trailer obviously you put it in the area hit the sell wood icon you can also turn that tractor off because that's noisy you can also load in wood chips at the front same as normal if you want to take out wood chips you come around the back load your trailer in jobs are good now this is also classed as a production chain so in out you know same sort of thing you haven't got to do nothing you haven't got to run it it's there ready to go this is where your pallets are going to spawn obviously you've got the warning signs here they're in the way so you just come up to this little button there got the option b turn off pallet spawn there you are jobs are good in and then in a blink of an eye oh no it come out straight away that's all right there's your pallet of wood that we had in there thousand liters on a pallet jobs are good in. now what are we talking about from a money spinning perspective right so i've got a few charts for you all right, so the first section is obviously going to be how much is it going to cost so you've got to have water in now water you can get for free out of a river whatever so we're not going to include that 
you might have to buy it if you've got some sort of water producing facility but we're going to ignore that straight away so we're going to go down for the stuff you do actually have to buy or in this case that we can sell at the sell anything placeable so if you was to sell off the seeds for the slow version you would make 200 if you then go down to the manure if you were to sell off the manure and the seeds you would make 405 if you used to sell off the seeds and the slurry, you'd make 404. Obviously, slurry a little bit less on the old sellage. Now, this is where it all comes in with the fast and the slow versions. If you was to do the slow version, you would make 1,980 litres of wood per month if you were running one day months. If you was to use the fast version with manure, you would then make 3960 liters a month and then with the slurry because it's got the same processing power you're going to do 3960 a month again so you're going to use slurry or the manure but you're going to get twice as much out now that is very important because we go over to the next one this is all about how much you're going to be able to sell that wood off for so if you were to go down to the slow route you'd make 1980 a month yes great you then sell that off for 5271 pounds euros or dollars now, if you used to go for the fast with manure, you're going to make 3960 a month. You're going to sell that for 10542 And again, with the slurry, because it makes the same amount, you're going to sell that off for 10542 So this is great. If you're going to make it and sell it, you're going to want to go for the fast version because you're going to make twice as much. And if you want to put that into a sawmill you'd make a lot more out of doing the fast versions and then obviously the knock-on effect going into the carpentry as well you're making twice as much which is great this though this as a wood making facility is brilliant absolutely brilliant it's got to be the easiest way you can make wood on this game without a shadow of a doubt because you haven't even got to chop it down it puts it on the pallets for you jobs are good i mean now it's still too heavy we can't pick it up mind you but even though it's half done you're doing the the plank side of it the sawmill side yeah probably not the greatest you're probably going to want to go for the standard sawmill at least over the back there but for making wood this is epic absolutely epic brilliant right so drop it in the comments are you going to be using this as part of your wood production we'll see what people are looking at and don't forget, you have still got to the 9th of October to get 15% off of Andy's Farm merch. Drop in the link below. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. It's much appreciated. But from me, that's it for today. And I'll see you in the next one.